What a dramatic day in court in New Jersey. A teenager facing the cop, he says, beat him after a traffic stop. And good evening, everyone, at 6 o'clock. I'm Bill Ritter. And I'm Liz Cho, the officer from Carteret, on trial for charges that include assault. Prosecutors say he beat a teenager after a crash. The confrontation caught on dash cam cameras, and the violence landed the teenager in the hospital. New Jersey reporter Tony Yates is live at the courthouse in New Brunswick with our lead story tonight. Tony. Yes, and in court today, we saw pictures of what Monte Stewart looked like after those barrages of punches. But the defense attorney in court today tried to cast doubt on how that teenager received those injuries. May 31st, 2017, thousands of people have seen this police dash cam video that clearly shows Monte Stewart, 16 years old at the time, being punched while he's on the ground. Carteret police officer Joseph Ryman has been identified as the officer throwing those blows that the teen and his family say left him bruised, bloody, in severe pain and in the hospital. His father talked about seeing the video of his son beaten by a cop. All right, well, what part of the video did you see? The part when he came out the car. And all you can see is his head and the other officer. And all you see is the officers hitting him, hitting him on my leg. My son legs go up and hit the car. The car door shuts. And and all you can hear, stop resisting, stop resisting. Looking at the camera, stop resisting, stop resisting. Just steady punching my son. Mm -hmm. The officer's attorney suggesting in court that the injuries may not have come from these punches, but that Stewart had also said another officer kicked him. So how can you tell this jury how can you tell this jury that you were bleeding as a result of anything my client did and not the second cop who kicked you? Well, first of all, I was getting beat up for like a minute and a half. So I was already bleeding before he came and kicked me. When did you determine that? I was on the floor the whole time getting beat up, sir. Stewart admits he took his father's car that night without permission and got scared when he spotted a patrol car as he was trying to get back home. The defense argues the officer was only trying to handcuff the teen. The teen says he could only protect his face from this coming from Officer Ryman. You see him with his hands on your hand? Yes. You see him trying to pull your hand back? Every time he starts punching me, he grabs me. I'm covering my face. Okay. I'm going to let him beat me up. I'm going to let him punch me in my face. Officer Ryman was suspended with pay. I may also add that also following this case in the courtroom are two other men who say they have filed lawsuits against the same police department.